fidget spinner away. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Sonic Heroes, ladies and gentlemen. This will be the final part for uh, Team Sonic, anyway, and we're finally going to the egg fleet. Made of fish! <laughs> Very and aquatic elephants. this time around, yeah. Wait, did you just say Actually, elephants? That's a, swordfish. that's a swordfish, Jordy. Yeah, it's a swordfish. It yeah, looks like an elephant from the front view. It was a swordfish. And, oh, I, I remember this cutscene. Right, so and I'm sorry, that just the, that cutscene. Remember that cutscene just remind me. I think Icky does a pretty good um, this Eggman. Eggman. I don't know yes, he does. Yeah, I, I, think, think, I think. I think it's like. It's not. No, I was just. I was just about to ask. Didn't he? Didn't he record that in um, the one of our Sonic Adventure one parts? The genius unmatched throughout the universe. I think so. Yeah, he did. I, I remember he also. I remember he also did like a sample recording with the audio filter and everything to emulate it because I think oh. Hyde egged him into doing it. He had it. Oh, so oh egged. Got it. Moving on. But yeah, I'd, I'd say he has. Yeah, it. Logan can make. Logan can make those puns too. It's like it's not real. I don't think it's like a good impression per se, but I think it's still a good voice. Yeah, I just. That's not bad. I just feel like the dude. I just feel like you know. I'm, and if you ever watch this, I don't think he's ever going to watch it when he gets back. He's, he's kind of too busy. But just, I don't know, I, I do. Like he should give himself more credit. Yeah, he should. In fact, it's funny you make that joke. I have thought about seeing if he wants to join for one of the campaigns, but that's plans we can talk about for another day. Yeah. It doesn't mm -hmm. have to be just us, uh, just us um, for, for, the, for Sonic. For Sonic. We are for the other team campaigns. Yeah. Of course. Yeah, we not just us four. In fact, that is kind of something I have toyed about for a bit to help make play to help make playthroughs different. I did have the idea for like the three of us being throughout all of them, but for like every different team, we would like cycle out a fourth member. Like we'd have Jordan here for Sonic. We'd have like another one for Team Dark, probably like Matt. Probably have someone for Rose, Ooh. and I think I want to save Icky for Chaotix. That's fair. But I love the Chaotix. She does, don't you know? She also seems to have quite an infatuation with me for some reason. Shut up. Not, okay. well, who's, to say, who's to say the Jordy can't join us for all of them? Or, I just, well, anyway. Yeah, she, she can join us for all of them. We could just have another. We could just have an additional guest star for all the others. It'd be just like it would. It'd be kind of just like our um, one. Crash Insane Trilogy playthrough. That, or that. That's it. Uh, okay. Well, you missed. Almost. Almost. Okay. First this try. This section of it is can be annoying. Yeah, no, this can be very tricky for me to figure out where I'm going. Yeah, it How is. Do you this? Up and down, that's all you need to know. And all around? I don't remember having yeah. too much trouble on this with Team Dark, <laughs> gotcha ironically enough. Hey. Oh, gosh. If you win. Knuckles, you lied. Yes. <laughs> Knuckles, you lied to us. We moved down. Not this far down. <laughs> well, Knuckles, I moved down. I know. Well, <laughs> no, I, no, I agree with you. Don't go down, stay up. Don't go down. Wow. Now go I think down. the thing is, honestly, I think the problem that James had there is that he waited too late to go down. No, he went down immediately and they got blasted. Yeah, no, no he should have waited to go down. I was about to say, you can actually go down earlier than that. In fact, that's why I did when I went to Team Dork. Also, I don't know why the Swordfish is the big, like, this is, this is my big flagship. I would have made it the Manta Ray. It still looks like an elephant to me on the front view. The ma elephants He's don't have He's elephant the elephant, blade. see him blow. No, I don't like that. I don't like that toy. <laughs> I'm elephant the elephant! I don't like that toy. Oh toys. no. Everyone, you know, knew, everyone, you know everyone knew Gator Golf was where that crap was at. Gator I, 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 Golf was legit. I, th I, I, thought the, I thought the top shit at that time was Hungry Hungry Hippos. Yes, no, it was Hungry Hungry Hippos. It was Gator Golf. It was, it was not Gator Golf. Ga it was Gator. No. Okay. <laughs> hungry, 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 hungry hippos is basically just an elaborate board game. I'm talking about like the big plastic animal games. Screw the freaking Don't Wake the Father board game or oh my the Hell of Fun. I, it's all about freaking Gator Golf. There's like a, there's about like a league somewhere of Gator Golf players. No. And no. I liked. Um, what about Candyland? Candyland oh. was a classic, but I, Candyland was a classic. But when I owned the PC game, I never even I never really even played it for the board game. I just like going to the little areas. And well, that didn't work. Activities they had. Oh, jeez, that escalated very quickly. <laughs> this is the part where I'm like, guys, where are you guys landing? Oh, we don't have. Oh, thank God for these rails. <laughs> like, they, there's there's no way they planned this. It just happened to be rails here. We... When, does so when does Sonic and friends ever plan anything? 
<laughs> oh, Lord. Oops. Thank you. Oh, oh, I didn't run, don't you know? That was close. Especially for that. Yeah. Totally. Uh, just 11 days until freaking Splatoon 2. Nobody knows. You know what, just to go back to that whole elephant argument? Yes. Um, technically in Breath of the Wild, one of the Divine Beasts was an elephant, and that was with the Zoras. Yep. Yes, but that wasn't freaking elephant, now was it? That was Valuda. <laughs> The, that <laughs> elephant was. Guys, guys, I was about to say that elephant was actually Ella Fun. I'll see myself out. Also, also, I'll see, also, also, you're very generous calling it an argument over Ella Fun. I clearly am winning because Gator Golf is so much better than Ella Fun. I've never even heard of Gator Golf. To be perfectly honest, I've heard, you of, never Gator heard of Gator Golf. No. It was always it was always elephant. It was always elephant. It was always hungry, hungry hippos. I've seen the commercials for Gator Golf, but I've never played it. I can't do golf tournament for the ages. Actually, you know that's actually you know what? Screw doing it with James Logan. If on some blue moon occasion you and Celie ever come over here, bring the Gator Golf here. Playing Gator Golf. I may have to buy it again because I think we sold it, but I will find Gator Golf. Is Gator Golf even still even still the bell thing? It is. I don't even think it's so. I, 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 they still sell it. Yeah, oh, they do. Out of I know I they still sell. I, I know they still sell Elephant. It's like I've seen a couple Gator Golfs over at the Target that's near me. Okay, then there okay. you go. Alrighty. So Logan, so Logan's Logan childhood wins. dream can suit, can once again come true. <laughs> meanwhile, 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 I'm just gonna go down to that golf course that's not too far from my house and play real golf. I need to go. I need. I haven't been mini golfing in a while. I need to go to play. I've never I've been mini golfing. It's like. Scan. I think the closest thing I've ever been to mini golfing was like there was this one place that me and my friends went to once. It was like a hybrid mini golf laser tag place, but the mini golf section was actually it was glow in the dark mini golf. The place itself was actually just oh, underwhelming. Ooh. It was like three courses smushed up together, and it was as bland as all get out, aside from the glow in the dark oh, panels yeah. on the wall. We're back at the ship again. Do we just want a big circle? No, it's a different oh, no, one. Oh, no, we're destroying each battleship. Oh, there are different battleships. Got it. Yeah, it is the Eighth um, Fleet. I was just saying, mm -hmm. that's true. I was just saying, I do remember, um, I remember, I think I know what you're talking about. There was Oops. this place I went to, and it was like, it was laser tag and mini golf, but it was indoors. But like, when they say glow in the dark mini golf, it was just like, the, 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 put, the putters and the balls were like neons, they would glow under a black light, and then they just did like some artwork on the walls that would glow. But it, it was really aquatic like, where we were. Mine was uh, mine was dinosaurs and aliens, mm, but it's just I like that was it. Like out. it really, it didn't really like it didn't it it, it wasn't like a good reason for it to be glow yeah. in the dark. It was just you could have made it anything. Like if there was like glow in the dark like tracks or holes, that'd be cool. But there wasn't. Honestly, and all honestly, I remember was my all I remember was my friends going crazy. And they just started like four and like sending the balls flying against the walls they would like swing the fucker yeah, like super honestly i had more fun the laser tag section of it even if i did suck at it by the way can, laser can tag is say, awesome by the way can i say, say screw this iron man knockoff over here oh yeah that's oh, right oh yeah there is a trick there yeah, is it's more like um <clears throat> sorry yeah. i was saying he reminds me more of mech assault kind of I do, I will say, I did find out one interesting little exploit that you could do with them when you're the speed character. I found that out as Team Dark. Just do a healthy cycle of tornado move and spamming the home attack like nothing else. Huh. By the way, Sonic, why are we moving? Because guys look cool. <laughs> it's just a giant fan in front of them. Posing for the Cut. camera. Cut, that's good, Cray. Film for the next scene. <laughs> and they're just on. They're just on zip lines. Uh, Sonic, my invisible zip line's about to break. Where is zip lines? I'm up here. I'm on it. <laughs> oh I'm my goodness, it. yes. <laughs> and just for the sake of a joke, it's actually it Shadow wearing those legs. <laughs> oh yes! But okay, on the this, sexy legs, Shadow. This All stage right. is the final finicky. Yeah, uh, yeah, I don't. Like, I don't like this stage at and all. And it's easily the longest stage in the game. Well, ain't that a great start? And if you're playing. Well, at the very least, he's not helmeted, so he's kind of a pushover. Yeah, yeah. How do you how are you supposed to kill the ones that have helmets? You have You're supposed you have to off. take off their helmets and I think aim Oops. for their heads, right? Right. Take the helmet off. Uh, the well, tornado, I think. Well, here's a, no, well, no. With the, with the helmeted guys, you have to wait till they do their spinning attack and get dazed. Then you gotta pr pretty much hit them with. Well, I guess 
hit them with a well. In my case, I usually just use the use the uh, power dunk or whatever they call it, the fireball dunk with mm -hmm. knuckles. Yeah. And that's how that's how they that, they just fall down and drop their helmets, and they expose yeah. their weak spot. Okay. That's the, that's the uh. one annoying thing I hate about those bosses. It's those bosses. It's not so much the fact that they protect themselves with the helmet. It's more so the fact that uh, unlike the usual moves that can be you can pretty much hurt them anywhere and not have to worry about it. With those guys, you literally have to poop them on the head. Uh, or also, you, you, you just you have team to be blast very careful. True. That too. But you, now, as you're seeing, you have to be very careful. Platforms will fall down periodically. Oh, speak of the devil. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there they are. You know, Knuckles, we could Die. just take Fuck this. Here, good boy, Knuckles. Here, have a treat. Give him a cookie. <laughs> no, it's a dog bus. Yeah, no, it's a dog a cookie. <laughs> give him a cookie. You just give one. Thank you. Boom! Just explodes. Oh, jeez. Oh. Uh, too much kindness. <laughs> oh, I was thinking of, uh, I don't know if you guys have seen this from Sesame Street, but, like, Cookie oh, Monster like tries Kermit to and guess. Cookie Monster. Yeah, no, and it's, it's, not a, it's, not a, it's not a cookie! I love this one verse. I think it was a YouTube poop, where <laughs> every time mother. it does it, it, like, no, Kermit, like, the Kermit's voice gets slowed down. It's like, hey, there's something to read. Is it a cookie? And then just slows it down. It's like, no, it's not a cookie! <laughs> For some reason, this was really funny to just me. Just the original scene, some... Oh, careful. Just going back to the original scene, one moment that just cracks me up, oh. even though it seems like such a nothing moment, it's like, after, after like, Kermit has his little freak out, like, just Cookie Monster just, like, gently grabs him by the shoulders, just goes, Frog. Frog. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah. Calm down. <laughs> You're losing it. Oh, geez, another Iron Man knockoff. Oh, yeah, these guys are even worse. For some oh, gosh, 30 health. Mm -hmm. Yep. They're, beef they're beefy motherfuckers. And actually, if I'm not mistaken, these are actually the, the most advanced version of the E100 series. Yep. Oh. You couldn't quite tell because of that display, but they are. <laughs> I forget what number they are, though, but they're like 1, the highest, highest caliber. What the? Yeah, yikes. That's even more so than Omega. That's like Zeta or Zeta. Or so that would ex you know what that would explain why that would explain why that. Well, you never I, I, thought love, I love that line. I never expected it to self destruct when we hit this giant explosive plunger. You button. know what fun thing is that Jim's kind of self destructed. You know funny thing is that Jim's kind oh, of missed this it, part. But it's even funnier if you hit that little um, question mark thing right before you do it, where it's they clearly go that's a self destruct uh, button. Press it to self destruct everything, and then afterwards. Oh, oh I oh, hate the lasers. Ooh, nice. Thank God, thank God for Duck Elfies. And by the way, that whole self, that whole bullshit, like, wonder why it's self-destructed, that's actually a mis- that's actually a mistranslation. Oh. What's, suppo what's supposed to be said is like, Why would Eggman leave a self-destruct button right there in the first place? Or something uh, along those lines. Okay. Yeah. Hey, who puts an off switch on a Doomsday device? Okay. Yeah. Who brings rotten fruit and tomatoes to a speech? <laughs> that is true. That is Some true. On the, oh yeah, real quick. Kind of a hey, who put this ball of onions here? <laughs> Alright, we're drinking out of here! Hurry! Hurry! <laughs> yeah, one of my favorite... I just remember, um, a long time ago we were talking about, um, I think it was at the start of this, at the start of this session when we, were, when we were doing Ratchet and Clank and we were talking about the Amiibo, he's in that guy who, uh, who just bought all the Rosalinas just so that no one else would get any. Oh, uh, yeah, man. I, I remember seeing a guy who bought a PS4, like, one of the PS4 Pros or whatever. Uh-huh. And... Literally, he bought it just so that he could walk out in front of the people who were all in line and just throw it to the ground and break it. Jeez. But I'm just that like, where did I like hear this before? It was like a news report, but I'm just like, I'm looking at this and I'm like, not Lucifer. only are you being a jerk, not only not only are you being a jerk to everybody, but oh, it's one of these switches. Not uh, only are you being a jerk about it, but you also just wasted four hundred dollars to be a jerk. Like, like, who's really like the idiot here? The six million dollar jerk. Actually, that just kind of reminds me. That's like the most. To be a that's like the most ultimate example of the card crusher. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> really. To tie things full circle, full circle. But no, it's just there's just some people who are do just. Want to, I'm not even gonna show. Some people, people who just want, to, want to see the world burn. Oh yeah, I forgot I ac accidentally stole that joke from the nostalgia critic. Whoops. Whoops. The six million dollar asshole. Oh. That's kind it's of a obscure. Bit, we can rebuild him. Yeah, a little, yeah. It reminds me, sorry. Remind, whoa! whoa! <laughs> Goodness, are you trying to... Make sure you have your televisions optimized, folks. 
Spotify reminded me of freaking, um, sorry, it reminded me of Family Guy, the $600 man, or the $6,000 uh, yeah. man. We have to take, oh no, it was, okay, it was, it was, instead of one billion, it was, instead of the billion dollar man, it was the million dollar man. It's like, we can rebuild him. We have the technology. Knuckles, can you catch up with us? <laughs> <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's like uh, we have we can rebuild him. We have the technology, but I don't want to spend a lot of money. <laughs> so like his his left leg is like a rake. His right, his other leg is a trash can. Oh It's a magnifying glass for an eye. Like it's just eh. Oh, I never oh, watched the billion dollar. You almost I went backwards. The billion, I never I never watched the billion dollar man. But apparently it was a Me show neither. my parents liked watching a lot. Oh, to, to be fair, that's like before our time. Yeah, it is. Just like a lot of shows, now that I think about it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, like, to like, think of, like, like the, mm -hmm. like the sixties Batman TV series. Mm -hmm. Or get smart. Yeah. Oh yeah. Or Planet of the Apes. Did, did, That's did a G-rated Planet of the Apes. I was going to ask, did, did Adam West finish recording whatever yeah, he they did. were going to use? Yes, for he, he, he did. Oh, yeah. We will okay. still get that. Se we will still get that sequel. Okay, and I'm sure, I'm sure there'll just be a big, like, trippy thing at the end. Yeah, there's oh, definitely oh, gonna be oh, a trippy thing. There has to be. There has to be. With every I'm... other actor that passes away in the middle of, I'm just really or near to the find... end of, you know, production. I'm just excited that his final performance ever is going to be him overacting alongside William Shatner. Yeah, yeah seriously. Got it. And then uh, I remember, um... Okay, another thing that I guess I'm actually curious now, we're, uh, unfortunately, on the topic of dead celebrities, that was my fault, um, <laughs> is... Did Carrie Fisher finish? Yes, yeah, she did. Doing anything for Last Jedi? Yeah, I think she finished recording okay. it just as she passed away. Because I was gonna say, like, cause that's a, I guess in reality, that's something I've always been sort of worried about with these kind of situations. Is that like, if her character is not meant to die in Last Jedi, now they have to come up with some reason for her to die off screen. If they needed her for the, if they needed her, for or the just night. not bring her up at all. Yeah, that would, that would still be rather, you know, like, ambiguous. Like, real cool. Okay, okay, did anyone watch the Fate of the Furious? Oh, devil, no. damn it! Because oh, I, I, I was gonna say, I know that that one guy from Fast and the Furious, unfortunately, died in between Fast, Fast, Fast Five or whatever, and Fate of the Furious. Hmm. But I didn't know how they explained his absence, since he was a pretty big main character, but then of course he died, so he couldn't act in the movies anymore. Do, do. Yeah, oh, actually, up, if I remember later. right, yeah, you. Oh, no, oh, you got oh shit! On. Okay. Well, well it's a good thing I still have spare. Yeah, I was about to say I Thank thought you, you wasted it, but then I remembered. No, you got a spare there. <laughs> I looked. Oh, I looked out. And now for another self destruction. Didn't think you would do that, actually. Boom. Yeah. yeah, I won't disagree with them there. Yeah. At least it's an actual stage. Whoa, lasers. Lasers. Actually, kind of funny is that. Oh, no. Oops. Oh, my gosh, Jamie. And Where's the worst part is, yeah, I had a key. Yep. Damn. Oh, sorry, James. <laughs> sorry, you actually, Did you draw that specifically for this, or? No, I, it's just something I had on the back burner that I, that I realized, oh, wait, I could totally use this for this scene. Yay. I love that you <laughs> used that clip. In fact, you could say that moment was a little too rough. <laughs> and Damn. I was Secret of the Ooze. Which I don't know about you people, but I actually liked Secret of the Ooze. I never saw that one. In fact, I actually I haven't seen it. much of that, if any of them. I haven't really seen the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movies. I really should. Save for three. I, I, I already know how that sucks. By the way, sprint as fast as you can when to that point, because that will kill you. Oh, Lord. Yes, it will. Actually, fun fact, and I remember doing it even the first time I did it, you can technically avoid it if you stay as flight formation and just fly above it. Well, oh. shit. Way huh. to break the immersion, immersion huh? I even oh, show it off it's, in the Team Dark works. playthrough as well. Sweet. Well. Yes. <laughs> so, there yeah. There all the suspense. But we did it. I... But at what cost? At what cost? Oh, no. oh at that cost. <laughs> it's E for ex Evil. Effort. Every villain e for is lament. Time to fight Eggman. Also known as Eggman. That's not how you spell Eggman at all. And for that, who oh, gets this. this? 
I this, hate this boss with a burning passion from this game. This, bo this boss can be very time consuming if you don't have the right strategy down. Yep. I definitely didn't have the right strategy down because, again, this was the very first Sonic game that I played, and I was, I think, oh, how old was I in the year 2004? I think I was 11. I, I, I... <laughs> Oops. Oh, yeah, you don't want to be stay too far away from him, otherwise he will charge at you, and that's unavoidable. Oh, yeah, that's what happened to me the off. first time because I didn't get the now, memo. Now... In in the first boss fight where it was on the Egg Hawk, I I recommended recommended that you use the uh, power formation character for the for the Egg Albatross. I recommend team for the speed formation. This I would recommend the flight formation because it absolutely oh, breaks definitely. this boss in half. Because you can attack both the shield and. I just yes. wait until I use Team Blast because I'm you know that cheap. Oh yeah, that's that's another that's another optimal strategy. So team Blast Team Blast and flight formation are gonna wreck this boss something fierce. Especially yes, if you're Team Dark. Yes, it mm -hmm. does have 150 health, but I think that's team, it. The, our, our team Chaotix. But I think actually, the thing is that there is are... a little bit trickier. Well, Shane, that's actually something I like, is that this boss isn't, like, in the sense of, like, it has phases. If you can kill it and destroy all You're close. health, it's dead. Hopefully you can You're get good. it a team You're blast. good. You're good. No, oh, oh god damn it, get back here. Uh, yeah, just as a quick, just as a quick little bit of um, advice, something that will definitely help is if, instead of just Sonic, going straight no. for Eggman, Sonic, is if you take you out the cans first. Oh, right. I forgot. Here we go. Should Team I use West? it now? Nice. I guess I'll use it now. That's That should destroy it. I think it, ha it had like less than Fingers for us. Villains. Survey says... Nope. Not nope. oh, so close. You were so close. Son Whoa, where did that gun go? He went the way of the he went, went the way of the team blast. Also, something that I learned. Oh, he didn't way, charge. Yeah. That's not, also something that I learned the hard way. If you go off one of those ramps as he does his take th the take this attack, it hits you. It yeah. can attack you in midair, and you can drop. Like, okay. Yeah, yep. you you don't want that. No, you do not. Well, Sucks. finish him up, Tails. Well, Tails, Sonic. And also, I think there is a limit to the stage where you, you, you can automatically die if it gets to the very end. I really? don't think so. I think I thought there was. Will he, just, will he just stay at that hub the entire time? Maybe. He should. Die. Oh, jeez, don't Ow. die. Oops, jerk. You definitely and that, put... And, and that just, and that just glitched, glitched this whole scene. Oh, I was about to say, you definitely... Um, sorry. It's okay. Uh, you know I what deals? Sorry, I was about to say. It's okay, you know what deals? I forgive the VA that voiced you just because you wrecked this boss something fierce. Have an A. Thank you. Yay, I was about to say uh, you definitely put. Sorry, you definitely you saying, put the. Please. You definitely put the amount of times I tried to fight this off to shame. Uh, and me, and I'm gonna admit, like I remember is... that this isn't really much of a spoiler. I think I was able to beat it quicker than James just by a few seconds. Well, is it for you? But we saved the world. Thanks, Knuckles. Whoa. Compliments from Sonic? Wait. Uh oh. What's ah, that? no. I recognize that voice. Sonic! Run! I'm out of here. Get out of here! I want to marry you and hug you and do whatever couples do. <laughs> How'd you even get up here anyway? I did cut out the cut credits. We'll be showing that oh, off the Oh, but that's the best because, part. Well, no, here's the problem. They do that and it's the same problem with Sonic Adventure, which is like the, cut, the credits are the exact same every time. Just with different, with slides, different theme. slides. Right. Different and theme and different cutscenes. Different theme and they show the different FMV cutscenes. Yeah. Uh, but with that said, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for our playthrough of Sonic Heroes Team Sonic Edition. Uh, we'll be doing Team Dark, Dark afterwards with um, Steve taking the helm. But that's not the next time we're going to be joining up with Sonic. Next time, mm -hmm. we're doing Sonic Colors. Yeah. Oh, right. Woo! I almost forgot about that. Yep. Alrighty. I did record that. Actually, I actually recorded that before I recorded Sonic Heroes, so we're actually going to get to that uh, as soon as we possibly can, and we'll hopefully get Matt on board with that too. But in that, until then, <laughs> I'm James Extreme. Lucky Jack 20. Jordan the Cat 11. And I'm Insert Eggman Joke here. Yay. <laughs> the best kind. And all of our apologies go to Steve for the next playthrough. Till next time, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. No, I walk through the valley of the shadow if I can never remember that. <laughs>